That's a big box. Alright guys, Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. So a few days ago, uh, Aesthetic Revolution hit me up uh, to send a package and I was super, super excited. So we got a huge box in the mail, so I'm really excited to open it up. But I didn't want to unbox it without showing you guys what exactly is in there. So, let's go ahead and open it up. I am super excited, man. This package is a huge. I've been ordering from Aesthetic Revolution for years and uh, I've never received a package this big. Oh my god. Bro. So they sent me their new backpack. This is like, let me pull up the price of this backpack real quick. Give me one sec. So everyday equipment design 0275 sold out already. My goodness. Wow. I think it was around. The last time I saw it, it was around like 260 bucks, 200 something bucks. So really, really expensive backpack. Um, so yeah, that's, that's one piece right there. Shout out Aesthetic Revolution, man. And I appreciate you guys sending all this. Oh my God. Um, this is a surprise. So I'll talk about this in a second, but just keep that in mind. This is a big surprise. We've got... Some, uh, we got some uh, joggers that I already have, I think. Uh, but those are super, super nice joggers. We've got uh, off-white men's cotton utility cargo run jogger right here. We have got, what else? Uh, antibacterial silver, silver plus lightweight jogger V2. This is all older stuff, I think. So none of this stuff is um, the new, like I think they're coming out with the spring collection March 26th. Um, but this stuff so far seems to be older. No way. All right, so this is something I'm really, really excited about. This is the men's faded vintage heavy Terry shorts in large. Then we've got men's five inch uh, cargo short. Dang, this one, I really, really wanted this one. So I can't wait to try this. Let's see. Uh, we've got men's half liner legging running short, black camo, size large. This is super nice as well. Whoa. What is this? No way. Bro, this is the puffy technical cargo vest. I can't wait to try this, man. I was eyeing this for a minute, okay? I'm so excited. I'm so happy that they sent me this. Really, really excited. I'm so happy they sent me all of this, man. I appreciate it so much. This is the hoodie. Um, men's reverse, uh, men's reverse heavy Terry hoodie. Super nice hoodie. Golly. Oh my God. They sent me some essential <laughs> socks, man. <laughs> this is crazy, bro. Essential lightweight headband. You might have to start wearing headbands. Uh, let's see what else we got. So this is the black camo men's silver plus established swoop tee, medium. So all the tops should be medium, I think. Uh, let's see what this is. Men's performance mock neck, uh, mock neck long sleeve. This is also a medium. They hooked it up. Men's Distressed uh, Cinch Technical Tee. I love these tees. I wear them all the time. I get a lot of uh, compliments about them, but I only have the green one. So I'm really excited that they sent me uh, this like Merlot color. <laughs> I'm super excited. And then they sent me uh, the same thing, but in the off-white color. Bro, I am so freaking excited. So actually this is the garment dyed raw hem cotton plus tank actually so this is different than this one all right you guys so these are xl the waist is uh pretty good obviously it's big now the thing about aesthetic revolution um that i've always had to deal with is i would say my legs are relatively pretty thick so i have to struggle between like large and extra large so 
some sizing information for you guys i'm about 210 pounds six foot um my waist is about 32 33 so this is an xl it's got a zipper on the side both sides so if you want to uh, quickly unzip it and then take your pants off if you have shorts underneath really nice if you're just trying to warm up in these they've also got these pockets which i absolutely love zippered pockets you can fit a lot of stuff in there let me go let me grab my phone here so this is an iphone uh, 11 just a regular iphone 11 it's not the max and then fits in there perfectly and then you can just lock it up in there you don't have to worry about it falling out one problem that i see already is i can't fit my whole hand in there i don't know if you guys can see that but it's not a big problem both sides zip on both sides now the details i don't know if you could get that it has different writing right there i like how it matches it's the same color so very subtle it's not too much and then you've got the asrv logo right there They've got a zipper pocket on this side as well. And then they've got this little string so you could easily pull it up and down. You don't have to, you know, grab this small piece of metal right here. Really, really spacious as well. And then you've got an open pocket on the left side if you wanna easily uh, and quickly put something in there. And then of course, it's got the drawstrings. So if you wanted to Tighten that up. Boom. Now it's nice and tight. It's not gonna slide down even if I pull on it. There it is. And then I usually like to uh, wear my joggers a little bit higher. So I usually like to wear them something like this. And even for XL, they fit nice and tight around the calf and the ankle. So they fit really, really good. Let me look in the mirror. That's actually a perfect fit. I love how this fits. So there it is. I think, yeah, there's a loophole right here. If you want to stick uh, some shirts or some towels in there. And then I don't know, does it have a, it's got a zippered pocket right in the middle right here. If you want to fit something in there. So yeah, the phone can fit in there. If you really wanted to use that back pocket as a phone uh, holder, I personally wouldn't use it as a phone holder, but if you're going on a long jog or long run, that would be beneficial. But yeah, overall, these joggers are amazing. They fit amazing and they feel really, really good. I'm glad they sent an XL for this one because it does ton, uh, tend to run a little bit tight. So one thing I'm going to pair up with this is the... Uh, this is, I'm really, really excited about this one. It's the Black Camo Train Light T. Let me see exactly what it's called. Men's Silver Plus Established Swoop T. That's what it says on the bag. This is a medium. So there it is, looks really, really nice. Let's go ahead and put it on. Look at this fit. This is a nice fit, man. So again, this is a medium, super, super lightweight. It's mesh, so it's very, very breathable. Can't wait to wear it in the summer. It's got a scoop both sides. This might be my favorite uh, outfit so far. We haven't even tried anything on yet. So this is the first two things that I've tried on. Looks really, really good. They've got, it looks like some enforcement right here. So, it looks cool too. I like how they did it red, so hopefully it doesn't rip if you put a lot of pressure going this way. Both sides, it's got the Silver Plus uh, reflective logo right there. And then the design, and then the nice uh, reflective logo on the front chest as well. Looks really, really good. Boom, so there it is. And yeah, overall, looks really, really good. One uh, little detail I love about this is how the neck fits. It's a little bit higher than regular uh, t-shirts that you would regularly wear. It's a little bit taller and it feels really, really good. It looks good as well. So I'm really, 
I am loving this outfit, really, really loving this outfit, but I'm gonna try the vest on, see how the vest looks with this. I can't wait to try this vest. Oh my God, look how, look how freaking heavy duty this is, man. Like the bag is like two by, two feet by three feet for gas sakes, man. This is, I'm glad they sent a large. So this is a large, the previous vest that I uh, got from Aesthetic Revolution, it was a medium. And honestly, it was way too tight. And I'll, I'll try to bring that out here in a second. But this is a large. Okay, check this out, man. <laughs> Before I wear it. Look at the inside, bro. <laughs> look at the inside. It is like the softest material I have ever felt. It's softer than fleece. It literally feels like... What are those soft things called? Ch uh, chinchilla? <laughs> Chinchillas, man. Like, that's how soft it feels. So this is really, really nice. So this vest feels really, really good. It fits amazing as well. So I'm glad again, they sent a large, so many little details in this. So let's go over each one. It's got the two front uh, pockets right here. So if you want to store anything there, you can. It's got zipper pocket on the side. So you can store pretty much two things in one area. You can store something in the front. You can store something on the side. They're two separate pockets. So keep that in mind. Same thing on this side, another zippered pocket. Let's see what else. Obviously they got a zipper to zip up. They've got a long neck to cover your neck in the winter. It's got the reflective uh, lettering here. So I think the gray uh, stripe that runs across here is reflective as well. Um, they've also got a little red tag right here. Nice little detail, ASRV. And then on the back, it has an aesthetic ASRV uh, reflective logo as well. Super nice, I love how big it is. Um, and then they've also got a pocket. Let me check how big the pocket is real quick. So it says the Dev Devo duck down filled with this product is clean down, which gets through a national quarantine procedure as high quality approved by inspection agency certified by IDFB. Um, and then we've got the, this, this is really cool actually. That's a very cool small feature right there. And then let's see. So this is the pocket they have back here. Oh my God, so that fits, golly, that fits half of my arm in the pocket itself. So really, really spacious pocket. You can fit a lot of stuff in there. So I can see how, how useful this vest would be. Um, I'm really, really excited to use it. So really, really nice. And then I also live in Colorado, so we get a lot of cold weather um, and, and very frequent weather changes. So a vest is super nice because you could easily put it on and take it off. It doesn't provide too much warmth to where if you put it on, you're gonna start sweating instantly. But if you put it on, obviously with this um, interior and with the down fill, you're gonna get pretty warm, keep your chest nice and warm. So really, really nice vest. Very impressed uh, with this with this vest. Now, I don't know if I would wear this combination in, in the gym, uh, but I'm definitely gonna see how it looks. This is the off-white tank. I just wanna see how it looks with the off-white uh, joggers as well. By the way, this is super soft, extremely soft fabric. I love uh, the fabric that they used for this tank and for the oversized uh, cinch tee. So let's go ahead and put it on. So they've got the embroidered lettering right here. And then the embroidered uh, logo on the front as well. Really nice, super, super soft, very comfortable. The most comfortable tank I've ever worn hands down. So this is super amazing, really, really impressed. It is also extremely long as you guys can see. It goes pretty much halfway down my thigh. And then on the back, same thing. So this would be a perfect tank for any day. But for me specifically, I would love to do leg day in this. I can't wait, I can't wait. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna put on uh, the oversized tee, the cinch tee, same fabric, I believe it uses. So um, imagine I wanted to layer 
for example, this tank with this T right here. So as you guys can see, it's got the embroidered uh, logo on the front and then Relentless Pursuit embroidered on the back as well. I'm wondering how this will look. Is this a medium? So this is a medium. I also have a large that I can go grab. Show you guys how a large would fit. So there's that. Let me see how it looks. Actually, that looks way better than the large. Yeah, way better. So I'm, I'm liking this a lot more than I like how the large fits. So uh, if you're thinking about getting the cinch T, go true to size, do not size up. Uh, the only thing I would size up is if you're gonna get the vest or any outerwear, or we'll see anything else in this uh, review that you should size up. But for this uh, T, even though it's oversized, stick true to size. The problem with the um, large that I have is that these sleeves kind of poke out too much. So uh, if, I'll, if I'm standing like this, the sleeves will kind of be pointing more that way, more lateral. So it kind of looks funny to me, but the medium fits amazing. There's the back. And then of course, you've got the cinch right here. Now this is interesting. I, I like how they have the, uh, the black circles um, because with the green one that I have, there is not the black circle on this one and it's beginning to rip a little bit. So I'm glad they did that, they changed that up. So you could get it really nice and tight if you wanted to, and then just simply wear it without the uh, bottom showing pretty much. If you wanted to wear it something like this, you can do that and it'll, it'll prevent it from riding up too much. Let's go ahead and try some other stuff on. Alrighty guys, so this is the Performance Mock Neck uh, Long Sleeve. As you guys can see, it has an elongated uh, neck sleeve right here. So if you're running out or if the gym is cold, uh, you could easily wear this and stay nice and warm. It's got the embroidered logo up here, which looks really, really nice. I love that. It's not reflective, so keep that in mind. It does have reflective lettering right on the back as well. Really cool design that ASRV uh, comes out with as well. And then it is relatively long, so it is nice and long um, on the bottom as well and on the sleeves. So if you like that, if you like to cover your hands, you could do that with this tee as well. Looks really, really good. Now this has more of a, uh, more of like a sweat wicking kind of material. It's a lot thinner, uh, more like elastic than the uh, cinch tee and the tank. So this stuff right here is a lot more cottony. It feels more of like a spandex material rather than a thick cottony uh, warm material. So this is uh, a lot more performance oriented, I would say. And then I love the, the stitching, flat lock stitching. All the small details with ASRV is perfect. It's, it's pretty much right on, uh, they hit right on the mark. So every little detail is perfect with this stuff. So there it is. There we go. So the zipper is a little hard to get in, not gonna lie. But once it's fully zipped up, it's nice. The chest is not, not too tight. It's perfect. You can still see the logo. There it is. Ooh, this is nice. This is super, super nice. So I'm gonna come in a little bit. Can you see the how fuzzy it is? So it's really nice and fuzzy. So if you want to cuddle somebody, you'll be like a freaking blanket to them. So <laughs> this is like the coziest outfit you could ever wear. This is amazing for leg day. If you're going to hit legs, you have to wear this hoodie. So I'm going to put on some shorts and see how it matches up. Let me talk about the details first. Getting ahead of myself. So on the inside of the hoodie, the material kind of it actually it does feel and look like this. So it's not as soft on the inside. It's still super, super comfortable though. Um, and they probably did it for performance uh, purposes. It's probably more like sweat wicking on the inside. And then fluffier on the outside. This is again a medium. So it does fit perfect. I'm glad I didn't si size up actually. Uh, one thing that you do have to mention though, or that I do have to mention is if you have a big head, you might want to size up because the neck is a little tight. And I had, uh, I have a big head myself. So if you have a big head like me, you might want to size up a little bit, but 
Um, other than that, it's perfect. I love how the chest fits. I love how the shoulders and arms fit, not too long. Fits perfect, man. This is how the hoodie looks as well. Oh, it's a big hoodie. So if you want to squat and feel like you're in a, a dungeon, you can do that as well. There it is. And let me go ahead and put on some shorts. They're super nice. I love how, so these are the uh, men's faded vintage uh, heavy terry shorts. Large, these are size large. Um, I love them, man. I love how they fit. They're perfect. I'm six foot again, so this is how they fit. It's got the embroidered logo on the left pocket. By the way, the left pocket is open. The right pocket is zippered. Both are super spacious, so you don't have to worry about space. They've got an open back pocket and then a, a towel and shirt loop on the left side right there. And then they've got this D-ring on the uh, left side. So if you want to attach a keychain or anything like that, you could put it right there. And then of course, you've got your adjustable drawstrings. And that is it. The material, by the way, is very similar to, to this material right here. So if you could look at the texture of this and compare it to the texture of these shorts. So they're pretty much identical. So this will be a really good outfit for leg day. I cannot wait to try it. We are in a quarantine right now though. So unfortunately, there's not gonna be a workout video in this yet. But as soon as uh, some good stuff happens, I will work out in this. So let me show you guys some details on the socks. It's got compression pretty much all around the foot. So if you have flat feet, uh, or if you struggle with circulation, these would be super, super nice. And then they're labeled right and left, so you don't have to worry about mixing them up. And then, of course, they got the ASRV training logo, and then Relentless Pursuit right there. So let's go ahead and put those on. So there it is. You've got the socks. They're really, really tight and compressed. And then these have to be my favorite shorts of all time. These are the cargo uh, five inch shorts with the liner underneath. They've got the shirt and towel loop on the left side. They've got two zippered pockets, cargo pockets, really spacious, both sides. And then it's got the reflective lettering on both sides as well. It's got the cargo, or sorry, the uh, reflective drawstrings. And that is pretty much it, man. I cannot wait to hit legs in these. Ooh, it's at least a hundred pound increase in my max, hands down. <laughs> And then one thing I forgot to mention, they've got a uh, pocket on the liner underneath. And this liner, by the way, so I purchased their, actually, let me go grab something. Hold on. So I purchased a while ago, their uh, gray, regular gray shorts, and they had a liner, uh, but the liner was super uncomfortable on these shorts. So I had to rip them out. Even with this one, this was the first short that I bought from them. And, uh, yeah, I ripped that liner out as well. But this liner right here feels way, way more comfortable. The pocket is way bigger. There's a lot more area uh, in, in your private part area because that's the thing that I hated about the liner with these shorts is that the, the liner was way too compressed and would ride up way too much. So this gives you a perfect amount of space. It's still really compressed, but very, very comfortable. So 10 out of 10, hands down, 10 out of 10 shorts. No problem with these. All right, so these are the black camo men's half liner legging running short. This is a size large again. And then it's paired up with the silver plus uh, T. This I bought with myself. So this they did not send to me. I bought it right before they actually sent me this package. And I absolutely love these shirts. They're amazing. They're pretty thick, uh, relatively thick compared to other um, performance oriented shirts and tops. So I love it, it's nice, it's white, it's scooped, um, it looks really, really good. So the shorts, they've got the loop again, 
that is seems to be universal uh, between all these shorts that I've reviewed so far. So you can put a towel and shirt there. They've got a liner as well. Again, the liner is super comfortable. This has got a pocket right up here. Really, really nice. These seem to be a little bit tighter than the cargo uh, shorts, just a tiny bit tighter. Um, so if you really, really wanted to, if you're in between sizes, uh, you could go size up. If I had known this before, I probably would have gotten an XL instead of a large. Um, but yeah, still the large fits good. So even if you get true to size and you want your shorts to, to run a little bit tight, you could go true to size on that as well. Well, I think they've got, and then they also almost forgot they got a zippered pocket right here on the back right side. They've got a very discreet right zippered pocket on the right, right zippered pocket on the right. And then they've got a left open pocket. And then again, the reflective uh, drawstrings or draw cords, amazing shorts, but, but, I still like the cargo shorts more. They're still my favorite. All right, you guys, so this is the antibacterial silver plus lightweight jogger V2. These are super, super comfortable. These are XL, by the way, so keep that in mind. They got the huge logo and lettering on the left side. They've got a right zippered pocket and a left open pocket. And this is how they look. No pockets on the back, it seems like. And then one thing to mention is they do have a cuff right here on the bottom. So if you wanted to roll that up, you could easily do so. And then they've also got a towel loop right here on the back left side. Again, this looks really, really good. And it's super comfortable, by the way. The material is pretty soft. It's actually very similar and it matches this perfectly. I think it's the same fabric actually. Uh, as the top, so this is a perfect outfit right here. All right, you guys, so this is the men's everyday signature cuffed jogger in olive. Uh, this is an XL. Now, it's funny because I just purchased uh, these joggers with my own money as well. Same size, same everything. I love these joggers, man. They, they're amazing. They fit good. They're really, really comfortable. Left open pocket, right zippered pocket. And then another right vertical pocket to put your phone in, wallet, credit card, keys, anything like that, um, and just secure it in there. And then they've also got the uh, little loop right here for towels and shirts. Um, and then little design specs. You can see the kind of the knee patch. You can see the stitching here, stitching right there, but it doesn't go on the back. So it's just one stitch right there instead of two. Um, but yeah, you could easily roll these up. Now keep in mind, I've had a uh, kind of, with the signature fabric, it does shrink a little bit. So these do look a little big right now, but after you wash them, it'll shrink a tad bit and fit a lot better. So this is an XL. I would still go with the XL, even if it fits a little big when you first try it on after the first wash it'll fit perfect so this is the essential lightweight headband that they sent as well i never wear a headband so this might look funny we'll see actually that doesn't look bad it looks really nice <laughs> dang so actually i don't know it doesn't look doesn't look bad i might I might start wearing this in the summer especially because my forehead gets real shiny with all the sweat that that i'd be uh sweating so um anyways that's how it looks really nice soft comfortable kind of scrunches up here towards the back so it's not a big thick old headband pretty much at the back of your head so it's nice and thick in the front and then it tapers down and gets really slim in the back let me turn around for you guys so there it is really really nice and slim back here and then it gets bigger, so it's very comfortable. I never wear headbands, but this is actually really comfortable. I would not mind wearing this at all. And then it's got the reflective uh, letters on the front as well, ASRV. So if you're running outside at night, this would definitely be a smart addition to your collection. Alrighty guys, two items left. If you have made it this far, make sure to drop a like, man. Hit a subscribe button, so that way you can see this gear in action. 
And again, shout out Aesthetic Revolution, man. I appreciate it. So this is the backpack right here. So many features, man. It's, it's ridiculous. I uh, can't really do it justice. It has these uh, clamps right here. You could easily take it on, or sorry, take it off and put it back on. Um, it's got this little pouch. You could put Interesting. So that opens up and gives you a huge pouch right there. So you could, that is really beneficial. And then of course with this design right here, you could attach so many things, different things to this backpack. It's pretty much as customizable as you want. Um, but this pouch is really, really cool actually. And then you could put something in there and then tighten it up to secure it. So really, really handy. And then with this, you could put um, towels in there, shirts, uh, pretty much anything that you could fit in there. You could just attach it there. For example, maybe a lifting belt even, and then just fit it right in there. Now there's also something, these are really easy to take off by the way. Really, really cool design on those. And then on the bottom, you've got a pocket as well, and it is ventilated, so you don't have to worry about moisture getting in there and ruining everything. And then, look at all the details in this. Even on the inside, there's another zipper. And I wonder what that does. Interesting. Yeah, so that goes from the inside. If you wanna just get more room, probably, if you're fitting something really long, you could open that up, open the zipper up, and fit it all the way through. All right, so there's the ASRV uh, dog tag right there. Looks super nice. It's got the wings. Really nice zipper, you could open it up. It has a lot of room. You could put your laptop in here. It's nice and padded in the back. And then you've got a whole bunch of space, very open, no extra pockets in there. So very open space. And then you've got another uh, cool thing right here. You could put your sunglasses or glasses in there. And it is padded as well. So you can secure something pretty fragile in there, nice and zippered. So obviously this is super, super adjustable. And then it's got the D-ring right here as well. Boom. And there it is on. You could put this on as well. And then adjust it accordingly. Again, I have a 43 uh, inch chest all around. So this is how it fits. Boom. Sorry, the pockets are all open. Boom. So really, really comfortable. This is probably gonna be my gym bag from now on. And then last but not least, we got something special. So this right here, as you can see, it doesn't have a name on it for a reason. And this is something uh, I know a lot of people are gonna be excited about. So this is a huge duffel bag. Boom. So let's go over the features. It's got the little button right there. You can snap it off. So let's go over each compartment at a time. You can see the zippers. They've got that design on them again, ASRD. Really, really nice. The zipper feels a lot better than their first duffel bag that they came out with, which I had for years. And then on the inside, huge space. And then they've also got this pocket actually, which is super nice. So if you have like keys, wallet, phone, this is probably where I would put it, just so you know where uh, your keys and all that good stuff is uh, when you're at the gym, so you make sure you don't lose it. And then you can just secure it in there. Because when you've got your pre-workout, chalk, belt, clothes, all that stuff in there, your keys, your wallet might get lost and you might struggle to find those. And then you've got a little zippered pocket right here as well. Very, very spacious pocket so you could store more stuff in there. And then on the other side, on the outside, you've got a shoe slot, really, really big. Pretty much can fit any shoe size, I'm assuming. 
And then something to take note of, which is really nice that I haven't seen other duffel bag uh, duffel bags do this, um, is they've got ventilation here. And this is nice because when I wear my shoes, when I wear my knee sleeves, they get very wet and sweaty. So it's really nice that they have the ventilation here. Now on the other side, they've got this clamp again, the little Cobra buckle, and that opens up. You've got the snap buttons, and then you can put something in there as well. A basketball, shoes, knee sleeves, anything like that. And then afterwards, you can snap it back in there, put the Cobra buckle back on, and you're nice and secure. Whatever is in there is not going to fall out. It's got a net in there as well, so this is probably where I would put my knee sleeves just because they're so wet after my workout. Then on the front, front face, you've got the uh, nice Aesthetic Revolution dog tag and then the zipper. Huge area, could put a whole bunch of stuff in there. And I believe that is it. Also, this is way, way nicer than the first version that they came out with very very uh, good with the cushion really nice and soft and then they've got these straps right here so if you want to take it off or remove it um, you could easily do that so very very nice obviously it's adjustable as well you can make it longer or shorter whatever your heart desires um, but yeah that is pretty much it and then you've also got the lettering right here so there's that and I believe that covers it all. You've got the attachment slots. Actually, yeah, you've got the attachment slots on the other side as well. So you've got a whole bunch of attachment slots. And that is it for the review, man. So if you guys stuck out all the way uh, pretty much to the end of the video, I appreciate you guys. Thank you to all the guys over at Aesthetic Revolution, guys and girls at Aesthetic Revolution for sending me this. This is uh, like amazing. This is more than what I could ever ask for. So thank you guys for giving me the opportunity uh, to review all of this stuff for you guys. And I can't wait to wear it. Unfortunately, we, again, we're in a quarantine right now, so the gyms are closed. But as soon as they open back up, I will be working out in them and uh, reviewing them for you guys as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions whatsoever, please leave it in the comment section below. Make sure to drop a like if you've enjoyed this video or found it helpful. And uh, I hope you guys can subscribe. And inshallah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.